Hello guys, how's it going? I'm Majaz, and tonight I'm going to try this new indie horror game that I've come across called Forest. But um, yeah, I have pretty much no idea what this is about, so I thought I'd give it a whirl. But um, I believe that it, uh, it shares the same elements as Slender, I think. But um, but yeah, that's just a guess, but uh, yeah, let's just wait for this thing to load and let's give it a whirl. So um, yeah, hope you enjoy the video, guys. Cool. But um, yeah, like I said, uh, hope you enjoyed the video.
unless this is probably just a simple game where you just roam about. Possibly, but uh, yeah, I would have thought you'd have something to collect, but it uh, doesn't seem to be that way at the moment, but I uh, could be wrong. It's got the same elements as Slender, so... Speaking of Slender, I don't know if any of you have come across a new one that's just been recently released uh, a few days ago, I think, called uh, Haunt, the real Slender game. But, uh, yes, I'll definitely be doing a video of that, because... Oh, keys... I do need keys... Oh! Ah. Game over. Oh, that first pick keeper. Right. Shall give that one another go, and then I'll try this one. I think. Well, I might do that with my next video, considering how long I do this one. Um, yes. Let's try that again. Ah, right, right. Start off at the tent. I don't really pay much attention to <laughs> at the start. I'm too busy introducing myself and whatnot. But yeah, I do. I do like this, so I'll definitely put the download link in the description so you can <coughs> oh, excuse me, give it a try yourselves. And it is free, which is pretty cool. I know you're probably uh, a bit tired of me trying these, like you know, these slender type games, but. <laughs> I'm a big Slender fan. And I'm really looking forward to the arrival when it eventually comes out. Hopefully this year, but I'm not too sure yet. And uh, I do hope that it comes to consoles as well. Because uh, the developers on Facebook have like done a section so you can ask them questions and stuff like that and I've given them an idea of um, having it with move support for the PlayStation 3 which would be in my opinion it'd be pretty cool I like using the move control with the flashlight and the navigation for your movement and maybe able to 
record or take pictures of yourself whilst you're playing the game and you can post them to either YouTube or Facebook but, uh, yeah I think that'll be a pretty cool uh, feature if it did come out on consoles Yes, I hope you liked my um, unboxing video of Black Ops 2 that I did. Um, well, I did it the day it came out. The exclusive Kerr package. And uh, yes, it's been a pretty good game up to yet. Yeah. I've not really done much on multiplayer because I don't tend to play as much multiplayer as I do. I tend to play the campaign first. But, um, yeah, I'm not too keen on the, um, the strike force bits. I thought those were a bit pointless in my opinion. But um, yeah, other than that, it'd be uh, well, I have to do them to get the trophies really. Bit of a trophy buff on my PlayStation. <laughs> I wonder what those keys are for. Well, I've not seen the ring girl yet. Which is good in my book. Inventory or something like that, but uh, obviously I was wrong. <laughs> but um, yes, in part two, I'll uh, give it another go at this and then I'll try that one. But um, yes, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Uh, I'll put the download link in the description so you can give it a whirl. But um, yes, hope you enjoyed the video again, guys. And this has been Hatcher Has, and I shall see you soon for part two.